Prayers for a Staten Island priest have been answered. His church launched a campaign last July to find him a kidney donor. The match was not only someone he knew, but someone CBS 2's Lisa Rosner had interviewed before. How are you feeling? I am doing great. I felt great immediately. I mean, as soon as I woke up in the recovery room, um, I, I felt a, the difference. Father Angelo Machula has a new lease on life, a new kidney the 42-year-old desperately needed after being diagnosed with stage 4 kidney disease a year ago. At one point, he even began dialysis. Back in July at the Holy Family Church of Staten Island, he told us... You look at the worst case scenario, what could happen, and as long as you're willing to accept that, everything else is going to be a grace of God. Parishioners promoted the Share Your Spare campaign, getting calls even from Australia. Whatever we can do to support him in any way, we're here to do. And little did we know, she, Suzanne Dasher, a church employee and parishioner, already stepped up, undergoing testing. Later learning in September she was a match. The pair underwent surgery two weeks ago at Cooperman Barnabas Medical Center in New Jersey. Dasher returned to work this week in time for the start of Lent. Everything has been completely peaceful and perfect. When God speaks to you, sometimes you just got to be still and listen. Dasher says her three sons look up to Machula, boasting about his tattoos, the fact that he rides a motorcycle, but most importantly, his down-to-earth demeanor. She says they know their mom did not hesitate to help. They're just like, oh, this is just like a normal thing, and that's good. I want them to think of giving back and giving to somebody and helping somebody when they can as a normal, everyday thing. It literally, it just kind of solidifies and, and cements the fact that we're all a family here in this parish. The father hopes doctors clear him to return to church in a few months. He's aiming for July to get back on his motorcycle. In Westerly, Staten Island, Lisa Rosner, CBS 2 News. Dasher documented her entire kidney donor journey on Instagram, and she told us that one person has already reached out to her, saying it also inspired them to be a donor as well.